Hi everybody, I'm Lydia. Today I continue give you a summary and book review. The second part, The Case Against Sugar by Gary Tops. The Case Against Sugar Not all calories are equal and the calories from sugar have the worst impact on our health. It may have had before a calorie is calorie. Thinking that five calories from sugar equals to five calories from an apple. However, this is far from true. As with anything, scientific nutrition hasn't always been as specific or once as now. For a while, most of us live by this conception, the first that all calories are equal, and the second, calorie intake is the cause of unhealthy weight gain. The sugar industry loves this misconception, as it allows them to promote sugar by making people think that a few teaspoons of sugar has fewer calories than an apple. However, modern nutrient scientists has, can show us now that, regardless of what popular brands say, this is not the case, and not all calories are the same. In the 1960s, accurate information about nutrition and price, with a breakthrough in measuring hormone in our blood. This allows scientists to see that our hormones work hard to extract energy from stored fat cells. However, one hormone in particular did exactly the opposite, insulin. Insulin is produced when blood sugar or blood glucose level rise causing the body to immediately, immediately store insulin as fast cell instead of turning it into energy. Once our blood sugar level drop back to down to normal, the conversation stops. And when what can cause this speed in blood sugar level and lead to an increase in fat store. Foods high in carbohydrate, which means sugar, this conversion right to fat store so that the calorie gains from sugar are not create equal like other calories. Even with this data, sugar industry has contained continue promote this message of being low calorie. With ongoing persistence, the theory is quite persuasive, even enough to fool some scientists. In 2050, a New York Times article published information that showed how some scientists still bring on overall calorie surplus as the main cause of obesity. Thank you. Bye-bye.